Hey guys, welcome back to another video. I'm at the beach and oh my goodness, there's dolphins today. They're so adorable. I just wanted to send you some warmth from California in January and I'm doing my first what I eat in a day video. So I will take you back to my studio and show you what I've got going. Okay, so here is the prep for my juicer. You can see right here, it's a Mueller. Um, it's pretty good. I've used it quite a bit for vegetables and fruits, but right here I have about a head of celery stalks. Um, I used the most of the body of the celery this week um, for salads, and then I am using the leafy greens and most of this to juice. And then I'm gonna add one baby little mandarin and some lemons. And that's about as far as I've gotten so far. I am also boiling up some beets and I'll show you those in just a moment. So here are the beets getting ready to boil. I always try to make it as easy on the juicer as possible. Um, and I just wanna loosen up um, the, the, the exterior skin a bit. But beets are such a great antioxidant. I personally love the root taste of beets and I love all root vegetables, but beets, especially in conjunction with anything that are orange or citrus, it really brings out um, the flavor. <laughs> Okay, so next I'm gonna chop up this radicchio, which is also like a cabbage, and add it into here, this beautiful green juice. Here it is, chopped up. And lastly, I have beets that I'm starting to juice. As you can tell, it's this vibrant color. So I will show you the final thing once I finish these up. Okay guys, here's the final juice for your viewing pleasure. It's beet, orange, lemon, and celery, and it's gorgeous. Look at this. I can't wait to take a sip. I usually squeeze extra lime or lemon into any juice, just as an FYI. And I also find that serving it over ice is so refreshing. Bon appetit. Stay tuned for my next meal. Okay guys, this is my favorite all time snack. The pineapple. Oh my gosh, it's just, there's nothing like it. I love anything tart and sweet. So I'm gonna get going on cutting this guy and I'll cut right here and then here and then down the middle and I'll show you. So I've cut the front and the back, the head off and I will continue. Here it is, lots of yummy chunks of tropical fruit. The other thing I've been obsessed with lately, I just got this new little cute teapot and there's a bamboo little detachable arm so that it's really easy to clean. The best part is there's an actual steeping thing inside. So I cut up a bunch of ginger shavings and you'll see I've just made some fresh ginger tea. Okay guys, I'm back for dinner, finishing off the what I eat in a day. So I'm gonna make a veggie stir fry with white jasmine rice. So for the veggies, I've got a bunch of little broccolini, we have celery, and I like to use all the leaves in stock. They're all really good for us and hydrating. Carrots, I've got a lemon, so here it is all chopped up. We got jalapeno, green and white onion, broccolini, celery, and carrots. So the first of my veggies is going in. I've got the jalapeno. 
the onions and um, just water for now. And then as this starts to cook down, I'll add the carrot, celery, and broccolini along with some more spices and a little bit of moisture. Okay, so I just added in all the other veggies along with um, a little bit of tamari. And also a little bit of the spicy taco mix that I mentioned. Good. The smell is so nice. So now I'm just going to turn it down on low and let it cook down for a couple more minutes. And then I will plate it up and show you guys the result. Okay guys, here's my final product of my veggie stir fry with white jasmine rice. I added a slice of fresh lemon and some fresh cilantro. I'm gonna go enjoy my dinner now. I hope you enjoyed my what I eat in a day and I will be back very soon for another video. Please feel free to like, share, and subscribe. Thank you.